Hey guys, in this session, we're going to be looking at how to convert those uh, words into mathematical symbols. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing you want to be knowing is that, you know, when you're working with algebraic equations, your unknown number, we don't know what it is. So we always write that down as X. Now, when you think about even numbers, even numbers, um, you know, you've got two, four, six, eight, and so on. And the way we can write even numbers is we can actually write it as 2x. So if an even number is 8, then x is equal to 4 and so on. Now as for the odd numbers, we've got 1, 3, 5, um, 7 and so on. We write odd numbers as 2x plus 1. Sometimes people write this also as 2n plus 1. Um, next, we have consecutive numbers. With consecutive numbers, if you think about it like this, you've got 2, 3, 4, so they're just going up by 1. So if we have a consecutive numbers, what we can say is the first consecutive number is going to be x, then the next one after that is going to be x plus 1, the next one after that is going to be x plus 2, and so on. Now if you think about consecutive odd numbers, your first consecutive odd number is going to be 2x plus 1. Um, and of course, every odd number is getting 2 added onto it, so we're actually going to rewrite this as 2x plus 3. So what you'll notice is the numbers up here at the end are actually going to be going up by 2 because that actually gives us consecutive odd numbers. When we look at consecutive even numbers, we're going to start off with 2x, but of course it's also increasing by 2, which means we're going to have 2x plus 2, 2x plus 4, and so on. And once again, if you notice, there is 2 getting added on to the even numbers and so consecutive even numbers means that well they're going to follow up after each other with two more than the previous one short little video that's it hey guys that is basically it for this video as always don't forget to like this video share this video and of course subscribe to keep up with the latest content uh, there should be some playlists popping up check them out good revision material and as always thank you for watching